President Tsai Ing-wen was seen at the Central Emergency Operations Center on Wednesday after the 7.2 magnitude earthquake struck Hualien. Premier Chen Jianren canceled his schedule for the day, joining his Vice Premier Zheng Wenchan and Interior Minister Lin Youchang at the center for a disaster briefing. Top officials have launched repair work on rail lines and roads damaged by the temblers. Troops have also been deployed nationwide to assist in rescue missions. A 7.2 magnitude earthquake struck Hualien Wednesday morning and was felt throughout Taiwan. Premier Chen Jianren canceled his schedule for the day and, alongside Vice Premier Zheng Wenchan, joined President Tsai Ing-wen at the Central Emergency Operations Center. Since this morning's strong earthquake, there have been numerous aftershocks. We are closely monitoring the situation nationwide and are ready to launch contingency measures at any time to ensure the people's safety. The central government will be in close communication with local governments to provide the necessary assistance. The military will also provide assistance. Through the cooperation of central and local governments, we will minimize the damage of this disaster. We are prepared to meet all challenges. Let us work together. The Interior Ministry immediately established a level one earthquake response center to keep abreast of the latest developments. But as the commander said earlier, we are still experiencing aftershocks. All relevant agencies must seize this golden window of opportunity for rescue efforts and start searching for survivors. The disaster struck just before the Tomb Sweeping Festival long weekend. Along the East Coast, the earthquake damaged rail lines and other transport networks. Premier Chen has given orders for urgent repairs. Subsequent rescue work will rely on smooth transportation, so we need to make sure that resource deployment is properly managed. We hope to repair rail lines and public roads as soon as possible. The central government has already deployed rescue crew to Hualien, where a coordination center has been established. Troops have also been deployed for rescue missions nationwide. The central government said it's activated an emergency response plan to minimize damage to life and property.